Welcome to Journal of Scots. It's a pick a brick wall video. Another one, probably, I don't know how many, um, at least maybe a dozen at this point. Uh, for those who have been on the channel, I love pick a brick wall. I think it's one of the best uh, price per part that you can get if you can get the right parts. Um, my local one is kind of, yeah, it's iffy. I really wish I had a bigger selection. It would be pretty awesome. However, with Brickworld Chicago coming, uh, I've noticed a pretty interesting influx of parts. I talked to the, the manager and they're, they, uh, they, they keep ordering a couple cases here and there. So there's a couple new ones. And so I had to, uh, I was, this is a part of a yes day with my son. So this is my official August pick a brick wall video. So in a moment, I will uh, get going. Let's start by opening this up getting the tape off. I would say I wasn't, I was in, we were in a little bit of a hurry, so I didn't probably overly pack uh, this, but it was spilling over at the time. So obviously it's settled over time now, but so I guess I, I would say I did like an average job in terms of packing the cup. Let's get into this. Okay, here we go. Let's get the lid off. So it's pretty packed to the rim. As you can see, there's some of the, uh, the dark gray and these are very interesting pieces right here, right out of the gate. Put those on top. I tried to kind of re-hit with a lot of really small parts. And you can see there's layers of red and a lot of black. So first things, let's kind of do... Uh-oh, they're flying already. Okay, so I probably should have skimmed this off the top. Let's get these uh, going in piles here. Get this all sorted. Let's see if we can do this in record time. Usually this does take like 15 to 20 minutes for a small cup and it really depends. The biggest thing is it just depends on how many different types of, so you obviously got a lot of these really super useful parts in a lot of ways. And uh, the dark colors are just fantastic to get in the uh, pick a brick wall. I'm kind of back to getting a few of these. I don't know what I'm going to do with those. <laughs> All right, here we go. Next round. Probably should just use handfuls and skim off the top. Let's do that. Let's do that. There we go. Okay. More black. These black 2 buys. I do have a lot of space for black 2 buys in my storage. So when you're at the pick a brick wall, that's part of it. Part of the battle is knowing, like, <laughs> which ones do you have room for? Um, as you'll see at the bottom, there there was some great parts that I really wanted, and I I probably should have gotten more, but I was starting to f I was starting to fumble around a little bit in this one because outside of this part right here, I didn't know what else to get. I did find these one by three plates that are a solid get as I kind of build up inventory for a potential uh, hoth mock uh it won't be a large one i can tell you that i'm kind of kind of shying away from large mocks i think in the future at least for now probably the only one that i have plans for is an extended um vader's castle that uh, that'll be coming up i have a i have a shelf dedicated for it i have uh i just need to keep buying Parts for it and figures. Um, really looking forward to it. Uh, probably the only thing I'm lacking a little bit is in the Sith Trooper or different uh, Sith <laughs> characters. Okay, let's let's keep moving this along. White in the middle. And we see another one. We got the single brick. More of those. I'm actually. It was probably a mistake on my part because I'm pretty sure I'm running out of room for one buys in my collection. So I may have to set these aside until I can kind of figure out how to expand. And maybe that's what I'll do. Maybe I'll take the, uh, the green one buys and put them in their own cup. <laughs> Seems kind of silly to do that, but I did get some one by four red. Pretty basic color, but if you think about it, for certain mocks, this could really play pretty nicely. So let's let's put those there. Keep those there. So as you can see, it's not like there's a ton of variety here. 
I kept it pretty simple. I didn't want to get like 20 different styles of parts in this particular run. Although <laughs> I couldn't help myself on these one buys. I really don't know what I'm going to use for. And I know I have a ton of them. I probably should have gotten more of these uh, red two buys. It's also kind of a valuable part. And actually what I should do, pardon my bad camera work here, is push these out because the camera can see a little bit better. So, there we go. Okay, this is good, we'll leave that there. Go two by. There we go. Okay, now, ooh. It's now a bunch of these four guys on top. There we go. Get some of these small ones out of the way. Ooh, now here's the part that towards the bottom that is amazing. This, uh, the plate, um, tile combo two by two um that one's going to be pretty amazing we're going to keep that right there i don't know why i got these one buys if i if i probably got any i should have gone brown maybe but i'm just i'm like hooked on sand green um, or more of these two buys you really just can't have enough i don't know like between the two buys three buys and four buys there's a new five by part um those are all pretty solid gets to have as you can see here the red is pretty strong sometimes you're like hmm why did i get all these you can really have enough never have enough two buys because you think about it too like two buys can actually be the same as a two by or er, by a two by brick the two by plates can actually add up to a two by brick. So if you can get a ton of these, it's uh, it's it really can add a lot of detail to your to your mock. It helps you add a lot of texture. So I did get a decent amount of these uh, two by reds. That's a good deal. It's a very common brick, so it's not like value. This is where this is a value because look how thin this is. And it's not exactly a common part, so this is going to be really awesome. And these, surprisingly, for at least a little while, they're probably becoming a little bit more common. Um, were really high valued before. Okay, so let's skim off the top, so that way we could just dump out. So I'm pretty sure the bottom of this is all one type of brick. Let's see, there we go. Okay, this is going, wow, I really did get a lot of that red, that's great. If I'm building like a, like some, like a part of the Sith base has a lot of red, potentially, so that could be awesome. I'm wondering if there are any other two buys I probably should have grabbed while I was there. Some decent amount of white. I don't know how this got in here. Random part. Random part alert. I literally every pick a brick wall. I don't know what how it happens, but there's a random part just about every time. I think some parts just get literally mixed in there. Okay, so oh, there's a random yellow part. So that's my son's part. He he forced the <clears throat> issue there. But most of the rest of these is all the huge heap of black. So here's my son's part. Oh, I did get I did get a bunch of these. Okay. So we are still gonna have to do some separating. Those are this way. Maybe I should have gotten more of these. Whoops. I did get some one by fours interesting and then I got some of these if I can, uh, there it goes 
Um, I already have a, quite a few of those, so I was kind of concerned getting too many. I think I put them on the very bottom just to fill it out because there's the the lip inside. is That's where you want to drop all your one buys. Fill that up. And then it, you then you put in the big parts, and then you you fill in the cracks with the small parts. That's how you kind of maximize your yeah, stand up here. We're in standing standing territory now with, for this. To on the home stretch, the August. Oh, another random part. Look at that. Look at that random part alert. <laughs> that's so crazy that those are in there they're just kind of sneaky now that was an option I thought about getting a bunch of them but those that same part is in the ooh I forget which um, one of the I think this this navy part is in one of the recent uh, dot series so I kind of avoided it just didn't feel like I would do anything with it. So here we go. We should be all set. Completely sorted. There we are. Pick a brick wall. August edition. We got the, the one buys. The glorious coral. A couple four by plates. Look at those random parts. Some black. Just a little bit. I have plenty of room in my collection for that. One by threes, some really interesting, and those those are probably not cheap. Definitely, probably uh, anywhere from three to five cents a piece. That that far one, those modified plates, and then uh, one by four bricks, one by two bricks, a good amount of it. And then this is kind of the probably in terms of the having rare parts. This one right here, this plate is kind of, uh, and I I'm almost wishing I would have gotten more. Because you think about it for doing a lot of like flooring and finishing or even some like wall work or any type of I feel like there's tons of scenarios where this could become super useful so again thank you so much for joining me on this uh, I'm a huge fan of the pick a brick wall as uh, evidenced by my uh, huge uh, my collection of cups that's just a fraction of them on my uh, my studio which is an absolute mess I'll have to do a video kind of showcasing all of them at some point um, I feel pretty good I've got a nice collection now I have a ton of parts I'm getting to the point where I need to start maybe building some mocks hint hint so thank you so much for joining me on my journey you're awesome and we'll catch you on the next pick a brick wall sorting video bye for now